Right guys, welcome back to my LP, and today we are going to go mining, because we are completely out of resources, we've got nothing to build with, we have barely, these are our valuable items, so yeah, we're going mining, but there's going to be a small twist to it, what we're going to do is that we're going to build a base in the mineshaft and we're going to stay there for a couple of episodes, I think two or three episodes. And they'll be pretty much mostly mining. So, if you don't want to watch them, that's fine. If you do, please watch. So, understand that some people do not like mining. But, so I'm pretty much just going to do some sort of weird mining thing. Well, it's not going to be weird, but, it, well, probably will be weird. But I have uh, found this really cool place just here which I'm hoping will have some form of mine shaft thing I found it while watching over one of my episodes I was sort of walking past here and just saw that and I thought it looks really cool with the waterfall and everything so let's go take a look well that's probably the worst way to start it off Hmm. Oh. Oh. What do we have here? Just into it. Already found a place. Also, we probably will need a lot of food while we're down here. Now, I want to get quite far down before I start building the base. But I do want to collect quite a lot of resources as well, especially iron, iron and coal, and possibly uh, some diamond, if I find some. Oh, I brought some saplings and uh, I think I brought bone meal. I brought a bit of bone meal, yeah. But I can get more bone meal when I get skeletons. And the reason I brought those is because uh well that's that's the waste of torch is I can have uh wood supplies on their ground. I completely forgot what I was trying to talk about there. And I brought some dirt as well to grow it on because I thought we may be low on dirt but I think I'm wrong. <laughs> because we look like quite a lot of dirt here. And uh, I'm playing normal right now. I will be playing normal the entire time. I know some people do play hard, but I think normal's better because hard it doesn't make the mobs harder. It just increases the spawn rates to like a really annoying rate for me. Whereas they never really go away apart from they never go away really apart from in the day. We need a lot of coal. There he is. Okay. If it comes to it, we'll have to eat zombie meat. Oh yeah, I got one thing. Whoa. But yeah. I'm not sure if I'm going to get the base done up today, the underground base. But hopefully we will. Um, oh yeah, what I really want to do is possibly what, like, I might do this when 1.9 comes out is make a nether portal and go to the nether. I am tempted to do it as soon as I can, but uh, they're making changes to the nether, so I don't really want to start its generation until it's 1.9 is officially out. That's that's one of my big problems, actually. I've found that they're going to be adding a lot of stuff, and I'm not sure if it will affect the generation of the world. 
and it's not so bad for people who've had a Let's Play series going on for a while because they can just say that the world's given them, you know, a good time and they're just going to start a new one. But, you know, if I just started it, it seems a bit pointless. Like, I suppose you could say it's the other way around, as in if you've had a long time in it and used so much time in your old world and this one's just started so not much has happened so you can't give it away quite easily but well but you know you can understand what I'm talking about oh. mm. I really gotta be careful but what I do and the skeleton's shooting at me from somewhere again this is quite a cool place here. This may be the base area. Well, yep, yeah, I think this is quite a good place here. Start building the base. So it's not going to be anything amazing. It's just going to be a basic little place where I can stay away from the monsters. I think into this indent in the wall might be quite good. Yeah. Oh, do you know what's good about the nether though? Now that it's actually got proper things that you can do in the nether, apart from just look around and think it's cool. Since it's got like an actual proper base, I was hopefully trying to maybe we could go and take over that base. And that could be way you know I could have like a sort of a hope because it probably won't spawn in one when I go to the nether so I could have this like sort of minecart track which brings me there and back why am I cutting down the dog with that so yep seven minutes in we're doing good No, I need to keep this place bright so monsters will not spawn. The only problem with what I'm doing here now is also is uh, you probably will hear a lot of zombies and skeleton sounds. And maybe an enderman which we are yet to encounter in our series. Well, yet to encounter off camera. I may have found one or two when I'm doing stuff off camera. Which is kind of annoying. That's why I don't like doing things off camera. If I find something really awesome, I want it to be, you know, the first time I see it, the first time you guys see it. So it's kind of that element of surprise still. Like, for example, this cave thing. It would be better if I found it on my own, but I can't help noticing that I did do it off camera and I really like the look of it. I know I said I saw it on the screen, which I kind of did, but I saw it on the screen then it went off camera to check it out, which I shouldn't have really done. So, uh, yeah. What are we on now? Eight minutes. And now that I'm thinking about it, I may, instead of just having one base, I may have certain bases like on the move you know what I mean now that I'm thinking about it because if I go down to quite far parts I don't really want to go up again because I probably first of all will get lost so yeah I might not exactly do that what I said I was going to do right, I'm thinking over it But we will stay here for a while, like maybe for the first episode or two we'll be around this area then we can move on. Good. First of all what we're going to do is smelt that iron. Go out here. Water.
I'm gonna make a place where I can grow trees, get a lot of wood. Because if you haven't realised what I'm doing yet, I'm going to get, get some trees growing. I'm just going to do it the quick bone meal way, where I just go like that. No, it's not enough. Uh, it needs quite a lot of space. I could dig downwards, that would be quicker, I suppose. See, I'm not sure how much space trains to grow. I hope it's not that much. We should be able to grow it. Quite fine. Quite fine. Okay. Good. Really? Oh, what? Good. Yes. Good. 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 So there's some wood. I want to make a door to this place quickly. Should have brought a bit more bone meal actually, I think about it. Although we do pretty much have an infinite supply of saplings now. So it will be good. Potions are another thing I'm really hoping to get into. And I have found out just today that you can just make all the enchantment books and stands and cauldrons and all without like going anywhere. All you need to do is get the resources for it. And the enchanting table, it's actually quite, quite hard to get. Like the resources, it has like three obsidian, two diamond, and a book. Which, you know, you, you do expect it to be quite high, I suppose. And we also need to go to the nether to get a lot of the materials, like gas tears and stuff. So I'm hoping to spend a couple of episodes in... Uh, my world just you know doing this sort of stuff like once I get into the nether when 1.9 is officially released I will spend a lot of episodes in the nether probably similar to the way to um, most people would do it like you know if they start doing something in the nether they're obviously going to continue doing it for a couple of episodes What time? My thirteen minutes. Uh, probably gonna have to end it up here. Wish this tree would just decay on its own quickly. And it takes so long. It do it does slowly, it, but you know, yeah. That's a very odd tree. And we will end it here with that odd tree. Okay, see ya.